Well, to be honest, I just have millions of girls that still are asking me about Louis and Harry being gay. <laughs> like, Why do people what think they're gay? Say? I don't know where it came from. <laughs> I do not know where it came from, but it's still very, very like apparent in my DMs that it's just such a huge thing. I, like, it's just they're called Larrys. What's a Larry? A Larry is someone who like buys into that conspiracy theory that they're a couple and everything else has oh. been set up to cover it up. <laughs> one, of the, one of the things that we, we were speaking about, which we haven't actually covered on this, was um, fan fiction. So is it that kind of thing? Where people make up stories about well, them? Well, but it's not... Fi- it, well, I mean, it is <laughs> fictional. What? <laughs> but it's, it's they believe that we, like me, management, ev- the fake girlfriends, the, you know, it's all a plot to cover it up. When did this all start? When did they start the Larry? From like very be- early on, One Direction. Really, and, and so it's still they're consumes... that they're together, or it... that they're both gay with in separate relationships. No, that they're together, but it's all covered up. So sometimes I'll be like at Soho Farmhouse, yeah. and then my brother-in-law was away with Harry, and then Louis's girlfriend posted at Soho Farmhouse a couple of days before. We weren't all together. <laughs> we just weren't yeah, all together. Just happened to be in the same place. Yeah. He, the, like Tomo was with him, also, and he was mates. Like, like, and it, does it matter? <laughs> yeah, but then it was just all of these things that I'm getting tagged in. Like <gasps> we figured it out, <laughs> and then they it is honestly it's crazy. Like the the things that they come up with. Isn't it kind of fun though? Like keep them along for the ride. <laughs> just <laughs> well, kind of. But we're kind of ten years later. Do you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> I'm like so. Like sometimes I'll do a live. So I'll do an Instagram live for like a brand. And I've got to talk about a hair tool. And what I'll do is I'll, like, touch my face. And one of them will write really quick, touch your face if flower is real. (gasps) And then they screenshot it. And then they've got... Then they think they've got their proof. (laughs) That's incredible. João Marcelo Prevedel, somos todos Larry aqui no The Voice Brasil.
great. And you know what? Like, you know, listening through those lyrics and whatever else, it's really nice to hear the truth in his music. Because obviously, I mean, you, you know, I know all of the full story of, of, about him and, 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 you know, his relationship with his girlfriend and whatever else. And it's, um, I mean, we've written songs in the past. Do you think Larry is disrespectful? Sometimes, yes, I do. Uh, actually, no, that's not true all the time, I do. <laughs> um, in case a few of y'all don't know, like, don't believe me, I mean... Uh, this is the box. Here's Smiley Bucket Hat, Louie's Bucket, the, the, the Bucket Hat, like that's what it's called, Smiley Bucket Hat, from Louie's merch address, my blurred out address, and then, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it says Harry Styles Fine Line Underneath, and that's clearly like the second label, and if I try to rip it off to see it, it rips off the second label. So, like, that's a different label underneath, and it says Harry Styles Fine Line. So, like, I don't know how much of a mistake this really was, but then, if I can flip it over, you flip it over, and, like, open it, it's, like, actually fits. And here's the vinyl. Vinyl set. So, I swear I'm not lying. I literally swear my my life, my family's life, and the boy's life that this actually happened, and I'm kind of freaking out. But I'm happy. Thank you, Louie.